be doing that. Making a music video. Of traffic? Yep. Cincinnati traffic. Starring everybody and their mother. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I do big cities. I ain't got time for this. Courthouse, I can get to where I need to go super fast. Mm -hmm. And I ain't got to worry about shit. They got buses up there in Courthouse? Nah. Hell no. They got taxis. They're not as cheap as Wilmington, though. Wilmington, you can go from one end of... Well, we tend to the other for $2. $2. And if you what? got the table yeah. disability, you get $1. What the fuck? I'm about to move to Wilmington. Yeah, Wilmington's spot. What the fuck? Yep, $2, Rod. Taxis. And fucking Corrals is littler than Wilmington. Way littler. Okay. And, uh... That's fucking crazy. What is it? I know when I, when I, when I had to take a taxi from home, to the store, it cost me six bucks. Yeah. That's crazy. And then if you need to go somewhere else, it's not. Right. They had another three. They charge you $100 to go to Columbus. To Columbus? Mm -hmm. $100 flat? Really flat. Like, bro, I can fill my tank up and not even. I can come down to Cincinnati on a Wilmington bus for 80 bucks. That's crazy. Really? They have buses there? Yeah, they, they, got, the little, they got the little they got the little little buses. Uh, in Wilmington, you see the little bands that go around? They'll take you in that to Cincinnati for 80 bucks. Really? That's a deal. That's real. I'll, I'll wait for the have money. Have you ever tried taking Uber? No. Any of those? I don't trust the Ubers. Really? I don't Why? Like, if some dude flipped out and tried to kill him. Oh, the rich, ran, the rich kid. Yeah, he flipped out and ran out, ran over like six people. Well, I want to tell he you, pissed, he was a little bit pissed. The one, the one. Uh, are you talking about the driver or the kid that beat up an uh, Uber driver? Oh, I'm talking about both because I seen oh. an Uber driver get a gun put to his face. That I didn't see. I know there was a rich kid that uh, had a tantrum. Yeah. Drunk. Yeah. That was kind of stupid with all his friggin' money. He's got to throw a tantrum about rates and shit. Privilege. Why don't you get your dad and send you a limo? It reminds me of that kid that ran away to Mexico with his mother. Yeah. How he got past killing four people with a car is beyond me. You know? I forgot what it was they called it. Homicide. Well, they could have the technical term, but what they got him off on. But the technicality that he was privileged, that he was uh he wasn't aware that he was doing wrong because he was wealthy. Was he wealthy, that kid that went yeah. to Mexico? His parents were wealthy. He wasn't, but his parents were. This is the part I was concerned about. <laughs> Bro, I would never eat there again. Fuck Arby's. Oh, Remember that day I came to work with that Arby's? Yep. That shit was horrible. My fries was cold. Cheese wasn't melted. It tasted like old ass sour cream was on my fries. Ugh. The chicken had like it was all extra juicy and wet and shit. It was pink in the inside. Oh no, that means that wasn't even cooked. Oh no, but if it's roast beef and cooked and pink, then that's, that's all right. No, but I mean, I think it depends on who's working that. I mean, I told you we stopped at, I was telling Bob, we stopped at, uh, Lou was hungry, so we stopped at McDonald's drive through It took forever to get through that son of a bitch last night. It was early in the morning, figure. And I got one of those egg white delights. 
well, it was anything but a delight. It was greasy, <laughs> it was horrible. I spit it out. I gave it to my dogs. I, sh I was going to save it to bring it back to them this morning. That that's kind of like I cruelty to animals? Huh? Isn't it like cruelty to animals? Oh, no, they love these. They love tomato sauce too. I have to make them some pasta. This is that afternoon get the hell out of Dodge traffic. Right here. This is coming from Cincinnati downtown, right? Yeah. Ronald Reagan Highway. Yeah, your husband was saying that we're gonna he's gonna take me down there to uh, to downtown Cincinnati one day to, so I can do some filming in the landscape down there. Uh -huh. That's what I do, I make music videos. So I film like, if I go to Chicago, I try to get out in the, in the lake and try to film the skyline at night. Uh -huh. Or I'll go up on the Sears Tower, the Willis Tower, and I'll try to film that and make something out of that. There's a lot of people in the New York groups that do that yep. on Facebook. Yep. We're always looking for the perfect shot. Somebody had one the other day, and all you see is the city dark and all these like almost look like electrical lights going yep. through the city, right? And they said one uh, a one word for the picture. I put in electrifying. Electrifying, stunning. I love my city, bro. You can do so many things within my city. Get lost. You could be bored in your neighborhood and just go to Manhattan. That'll be gone. Go to the West Village. Go to Alphabet City. Everything's changed. I'm sure Alphabet City has changed. I remember going down there to do some uh, freelance work for a writer. Mm -hmm. And man, what a dump. Oh my it's God. changed now, that's for sure. Drugs all over the place. I mean, it's still there in certain parts of the projects. Oh, but sure. Now you got the yuppies moving in the projects. So it's kind of like funny. See people that you would never think you'd ever well, why see coming would you out. Think, why would you think a yuppie would do drugs? Cheaper for cheaper rent for them. Well, it's cheaper rent and they can get their drugs. Yep. Who the hell is y'all yeah. talking about? New York. <laughs> We're both from New York. So. Oh. I'm like, what the fuck? He was lost. He's like, what the <laughs> hell is that? <laughs> Alphabet City. What the yeah. hell? Like, that's, what that's, a, that's a bad neighborhood. It was a bad neighborhood in New York at one time. You, you didn't go there because you wouldn't come out. Yeah. I ain't fucking with New York. I never stayed around there late. It was always like... I heard about New York. Yeah, yeah New York is kind of rough. It is. It, it still well, is in certain neighborhoods. I, I would say in certain neighborhoods. Like Greenpoint picked say. up a lot. <coughs> Williamsburg picked up quite a bit. Park picked Slope up picked up a lot. I mean, as far as, as, far as yeah. the rent, you know, the cost of living, the type of people that are there. We've got all these uh, European money coming in now. The Bowery's picked up. Oh yeah, I seen that. Millionaires row now. I remember going down to the Bowery. Uh, my dad used to drive us down to Delancey Street. He'd buy stuff in his store, and then Christmas time, uh, he'd take us down there to go buy my my brother's presents and stuff. You remember all the lamp stores they used to have down yeah, there? Yeah, they still are. Yep. Down around Chinatown. Yep. I remember that the last time we uh, drove in. Right after, uh, what was that, uh, Hurricane? Oh, um, Sandy. Sandy. I mean, I couldn't even go visit my friends downtown because it was flooded. Yeah, and it was a I, guy that was working an underground parking lot down there. Uh -huh. And his boss wouldn't let him go home. The guy ended up dying. Really? He drowned. All the water went down in the parking lot and he drowned. To show you how. You know what I would have said? Fuck you! Exactly. We had we had um, a fire thing at my job on the 13th floor, right? And I went and got all my stuff I bought at lunchtime, including my purse. My boss said to me, well, why are you doing that? We're just going two floors down. I said, well, you know what? I was a kid in the fire. Mm -hmm. You go two floors down, I'm out of here. See ya. <laughs> That's what I said. I don't know if it's me, but I really so, don't feel like Cincinnati. When 9 so 11 happened. Okay. Yeah, what happened? Yeah, I don't really feel like Cincinnati that far from the tour house. 
What did he say? He said about you don't like Cincinnati that far from courthouse. Yeah, that's why I'm surprised you were telling your girlfriend you wanted to move to Cincinnati. I want to move to 